Hey, welcome to All Leagues Matter, Gunner TV, Gunner Louis TV as well. Goes out to both my channels. Big shout out there. Uh, talking about the two Premier League games last night. Goals. My predictions. Oh, what? I, my Leeds prediction was more of a. You know, they did did Man City last year. I thought, you know, maybe they could. Uh, do something, but uh, Manchester City 7 Leeds United nil. now it's scintillating as City was oh, Kevin De Bruyne is 5th the 5th goal uh, outside the box, drilling it in when Nathan Ake is getting on the score sheet you know you're in trouble as well you know, let's forget Man City they were scintillating. and they were great. We know how good they are. We know what they can do. But this is worrying for Leeds. They're in poor form. They're near the bottom of the table. Almost in a relegation zone. Does it make sense to change their manager now? I don't think it does. I don't think it does them any favours at all. Let's sit. Let me see outside here. Outside the conservatory. I don't think it does them any favours if they were to change their change their manager now. So that's me breakfast. Just digest that. Um, Leeds are in trouble. It's good for Arsenal being an Arsenal fan because we've got Leeds next away. Apart, well, West Ham tonight, then Leeds away and. I was working out how many away games Arsenal have won this season. Two. Two games at Burnley and Leicester. Not good enough. If we can't beat this Leeds team, if they have the same... If they have no good players come back into this, the exact same team that shipped in seven of Man City, I don't care that it's at Ellen Road. I know what a colder in Ellen Road is. I know, but Arsenal should dispatch of them, and if they can't, again, Arteta's got to, got to go for me, you know, I'm just belligerent on that, he's just not good enough for Arsenal, but anyway, how good is Jacob Ramsey for Aston Villa, this kid is a superstar already in my eyes, and he He's going to be one of the best English footballers of his... I think he's a generational talent. <laughs> that that word, there we go. Generational talent. Villa have got one. And Jacob Ramsey, he is that good. The goal he scored at the Emirates when we beat him 3-1. We were 3-0 up, cruising, second half, late on. And he just smashed it in, top bins, outside the box, out of nothing. Oh. Whoa, I think it was left foot as well. Keeper just stood there and watched it. Ramsdale, he just couldn't do anything. And the goal he scored last night was brilliant. Absolutely brilliant from Jacob Ramsey. Running at the Norwich defenders. Jinking in, jinking in, jinking out. And he's inside, just inside the 18 yard box. On the left hand side and smashes it. Rifles it into the roof of the net past Tim Krull. And again, Norwich had a great opportunity in the second half. A mistake by Villa at the back. They could have capitalised instead of capitalising and scoring. With Puki next to him, I can't remember the player it was. He falls over. <sighs> Mate. They are the moments where you stay up and you go down. I think Norwich are condemned. What, what, seeing that, it was pitiful. But a good bounce back by Steven Gerrard's Villa. It sort of reminds me of Arsenal a little bit, Villa. You know, they're beaten by the better teams in the league, i.e. Man City, Liverpool and all that. Um but are beating the lesser teams at the moment. So, but that, 
take take no but you know Manchester United struggled at Norwich. You know Villa 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 went there and pretty much you know dominated the game from you know dominate possession. They looked, the fluidity in their passing was much better. I managed to catch most of the game. Missed, missed the second half. I saw the highlights. Ollie Watkins finishing them off late on to get a 2-0 away win for Villa. So, that's it. Um, tonight, the big one. Arsenal-West Ham. I don't think West Ham have beaten Arsenal home or, or away. I'm not sure away, but I think it's home or away for, for about six years now. Especially at home. We have got an amazing record against West Ham. So I think West Ham will struggle tonight. Um, but they have Declan Rice. So even when West Ham are struggling as a team, they've got a Superman captain that can drag them out of the depths and, and dig a result out. It's going to be an interesting battle. You know, Xhaka versus Declan Rice. I mean, Rice wins all day long, doesn't he? You know, but we'll see, we'll see. I think I think Arteta's going to have to have a plan for Rice because he dictates their play. If we stop him from... He's like a... He's like a Beckenbauer almost, but higher up the pitch. The way he spreads the ball around, and, and, and that is a that is a compliment, mate. Yeah, I'm not, people bandy words around too easily for me. But he is that good, Declan Rice. Seriously, man, he is something else. Anyway, thanks for joining me on All Leagues Matter and Gunner Louis TV. I'll see you soon.